Well, hey, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. We're on day 43 of this crazy playthrough. What is going on over there? Is it is Lieutenant Dan stuck? Hang on, we're on our well, help is on the way, dude. We got you, buddy. Uh oh, that's definitely not gonna help you. You're minus body from the waist down. <laughs> we took off a hand. Oh, nice. Now it looks like Thing from <laughs> Adam's family. Fantastic start to an episode. Nothing big with teeth wanting to show up? Nothing? Cool? Cool? So, hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you're having a damn good day. Wherever you are in the world, just know that I appreciate you being here. Got to show you something real freaking cool real quick, because I wanted to. Lovely viewer by the name of Nigel sent me a mod. Yeah! This is not the same one that Josh is using, and I know there's one on the Nexus mods. Um, but I don't know exactly where he got this one from, if he made it himself, but this one opens and closes really fast with the horn. Love it, so thank you, Nigel. I do appreciate it, sir. Sup, dude? Do you have any jobs that don't suck? Yeah, Checkpoint yeah. 3, that one's not cool. Gold Rush Station, ooh, that could be fun. A little bit further. And Zavinsky, none of these are very close. Look, Buckhead, I'll give you some... All right, shut your whole face up. All right, we'll go due to the NDC clear area here. Since we're starting later in the day because of the Horde Night... In Whoops. Uh, because of the Horde Night ending, we don't have as much time. How much range does this have? Oh, yeah. You can close it all the way. Oh, that's just fantastic. That should just be a default part of the game. Love that. Good timing. We crash our bike right as we get there. Hit one tiny little brick just sitting there and everything just fell apart. All right, we're going to park you right here in case we need to flee quickly. All right, so it's been a minute since we've done a uh, checkpoint station. Oh, he's posing for us. He's got his foot up in the air. That That's a good pose, sir. Let's see if we can take out your buddy over there. Maybe if we aim just a smidge higher, we can take him out without him waking up. <laughs> Careful whoever's off in the background. We just pierced his ear and it went off for distance there. All right, that, sh that should be right here. Got him. And he's posing for us, too. Y'all are beautiful. Don't let anybody tell you differently. All right, we don't have a whole lot of bolts left. Granted, I'm not doing a ton of sneakies. Oh, I just realized something. Come on, Cap. Come on. I hadn't even activated the mission yet, so as soon as I click go on this thing, it's going to respawn those idiots in anyway. Can I have my bolt? I can at least have that one back. Can I get the one back from you, too? Because if I'm going to have to reuse it, I might as... Um, maybe it'll still be there after I start this up here. I, I forgot. It was a moment of weakness. Can I... That ought to keep things out or in. See if it's... Okay, I see my arrow up there. See if it respawned either one of these idiots. Huh, not seeing either one up there. Nice. Okay, so I should be able to just run freely up there and... Hang on. Nope. Just run freely up there and be able to take all this... What? Oh, duh. It's inside. Wait, how do you get inside there? <laughs> I'm having the dumbs. Is it this? How the hell do you get inside? There's stairs. Oh, okay. Never mind. I'm, I'm doing this the dumb way. I think that's you go through all this after you come out. Right, let's just do it the way the game actually wants me to. How about it? There's a whole bunch of vehicles in here we can search. <clears throat> let's see how many zombies we can take out before they realize we're here. Not that one. Gary is awake. He is not aware of us just yet, but he's awake. How much are we good on ammo for this? Actually, I need this. This is where I put the rad remover mod, right? Yep. All right, so when things go down, we can be able to shoot Gary in the head. I need you to... Okay, tell you what. I'll come over here. You don't see me yet because I'm full-on ninja mode, and it's cloudy. Okay. All right, that's about all I can do. Go down and stay down. Hang on, I'm going to reload real quick. Thank you very much. Now I need you to go down and stay down. Execute you style and... Might as well turn the headlight back on so you guys at home can see. Come here. Uh, you're not dead yet, are you? There you go. Okay, not too bad so far, but I, for some reason, I just don't believe that that's going to be everybody that's over here. Right, give my bolt back. We got all these vehicles we can search, which we definitely need to. Uh, I could rip them all apart and get some gas and stuff. We'll just do a quick search of them and see if we get anything good. Nice. Nothing else I can sell that. 
Okay, this area has been looted. All the vehicles here. Here's all the stuff I got. I did get a book. Shotgun crafting. Let me put you on. Read you. Take you back off. Uh, we got another. We had a level five bat. That's actually not too bad. I mean, twenty eight point one versus fifty one point nine. Eh. But we did get a decent shovel, so we can sell this. Sort you out real quick. Stuff I could probably get rid of. Got a free repair kit or two. That's not too bad. And since I did get a skill point, let me see. I was wanting to put it into Daring Adventurer, but I got to get Intellect to level 7. And I have to have two points to do this. Now, I could... I think I have one in there, actually. No, that one's a Treasure Hunter's mod here. I think... Is this one... Yeah, this one just helps out with XP gain and loot stage. So that's definitely something I want to have on there. If I had one more slot, one more slot, then I think I have an XP or an intelligent buff at the house. And then I, it would automatically raise it up by one more for me. And I would be okay to just, you know, put a skill point into Daring Adventure as long as I have the hat on. If I took the hat off, then it would say, oh no, now you don't meet the minimum requirements. Why do I... I know I've been through this POI a few times. I haven't done one yet in this series. So trying to remember where all the zombies are, I don't. I'm sure we'll very quickly figure it out, huh? So we close you, or we open you, and that one closes. Go to sleep. What are you doing? Are you the lab assistant? Hang on. Sorry, I'm breaking stuff over there. My bad, my bad. I mean to ruin your entire lab here. Give my bolt back. Give me a chance to reload this again. Now, I know there's a bunch of zombies, like, all up in this general area, like, around... Hang on, let's just go melee here. This is going to be some close quarter combat. Where are you at? There you go. It's Lisa! Lay you down right there. And I believe there's one, yeah, right there. And I think there's another one with him behind this curtain. Or maybe he was the one behind this curtain. I don't know. I think that's everything that's in here, though. But we'll go ahead and grab the little bit of loot that's in here. So... Why you guys are here, thank you for being here, of course. If you enjoyed the video, do me a favor, leave that like. You know, the little thumbs up button helps out a tremendous amount, and you know I appreciate it, or I wouldn't say thank you, because I do say thank you. And, of course, if you're new to the channel and you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos. New videos every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Open the door. Oh, hang on. I think I gotta go... Isn't there another door back here? Yes, this way. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't like this spot. I don't like it at all. Tell you what, how about we do this? Each one of these tents has got things in it. Oh, hell. <laughs> yeah, exactly like that. Hey, there's Blobby. I'm going to quick scope you to death, sir. Pop to your top. All right, y'all can run around in this tent and just absolutely go to town on it if you want to. I don't care. It doesn't affect me. Not my tent at all. Gary, I'm going to have to ask you to stay down. Tell you what, we're going to come over here like this. Uh -huh. here, I'm going to shoot you in the back. Sorry about that. That's rude. I know. I'll shoot you in the front that time. Might as well turn the headlamp back on. Quick scope. You just got headshot, a baby. All right, now that we got the everybody normal out of... Wait, wait, you're not a normal. I need to get the glowies to go away first because they're the ones that like to keep getting back up. Stay down, lady. I do have an okay amount of ammo. I grabbed enough to have one stack. I didn't grab two stacks of ammo. All right, just me and you now, buddy. And then this one right here. Come here, Glenn. Come here, figure it out. There you go. All right, now I'm going to need you to just stay down a little bit so I can save some ammo. There you go. Good boy. Okay, were y'all hiding anything in here? Maybe a toilet pistol? I don't need one, but I'll take your nasty toilet water. But a little bit of extra pistol. Uh, extra pistols are always nice to have if I can words today. Just because, you know, I can sell them. We're going to take everything that we possibly can. Now, we've had this conversation a few times, but I feel like it's needed to be said again. Yes, I am a loot goblin. I do try to take absolutely everything, but... If I'm leaving stuff behind, it's mostly because of inventory space. You know, you get completely full and you can't pick up anything else. And that's when it's like, well, I'll pick up everything I can along the way. And then... Hello? And then I immediately have to start dropping stuff off because, you know, I'm out of space. So, while I do take everything with me that I find, anything of value, I do end up having to drop stuff off all the time. Alright, so these can give us some nitrate. We need that. 
I know there's other body bags like right over here that I've missed some of those. Like all the dead bodies here give you nitrate, so it's worth beating them up. And there's a pallet right over here. It's worth getting, you know, stuff like that. I do see I'm not completely oblivious. <laughs> not completely, only partially. Hey, some food on the ground, sweet. A free meal is always nice. You know what, go ahead and read you. We're at 50 out of 100 on that. Some sham chowder, nice. I'll just throw the coffee beans on the ground. I know, that's almost sacrilegious here. We don't we don't waste coffee in Cap's world. We just don't do it. But we're doing it today. We're going to go ahead and gather up all the gas you have. Just This should replenish how much it took us to get over here. So a little bit of free gas is nice. So yeah, there's. I would love to take absolutely everything that's not nailed down. And even then, half the stuff that is nailed down. But like hops, I'm not going to plant hops. I don't need them. So if I find those, I just leave them behind because it's like, eh. I don't really need those. So yeah, I do leave some things behind. Some things I leave behind intentionally. Some things it's because I do sometimes miss things. Allegedly. Don't be quoting me. Allegedly, sometimes we miss things. It, you know, it happens to the best of us. Make sure everything's reloaded before we go in here. So I do I do try to get everything, but I need a bigger inventory. Uh, I don't need blueberries. I'm not really planting those. Now I know there's an, a challenge for gathering blueberries. But I'm not... Okay. Uh, Lieutenant Dan! What's up, buddy? Who you got with you? Oh, hell, there's another blobby. How about no, Scott? Puke all over everything. Look at this, just glass shattering. Can you not just keep it all together for a dang... S oh, great. Great. Look what you did. Look what you did. Got me all nice and radiated, you big idiot. Well done! I hope you're happy. Is that what you were going for? Oh, you better have something good in here. Oh, nice. Coal. I do need that, so I'm trying to make... Uh-uh. I always feel like somebody's watching me. Because I got no privacy. Oh, sure, I'll take you too. All right, we're going to be definitely having to drop some stuff off here at the next, the next room before we can even get to the main loot. All right, you are good. You're good. Let's see if we can do some more sneaky stuff. Because I know typically around here things go really bad, like in this one room. Or in this one bathroom. Uh-uh. Shh. Be quiet. Stay down. You need to be whisper quiet. Inside that building sucks. Sucks real bad. Alright, nothing else in the bathroom. I'm pretty sure there's a couple zombies. Exactly right there. Great. Great, just fantastic. Hey, none of that. What the hell's your problem, man? I'm trying to have a conversation. You just hit me. Rude. Just respect your welders. Uh, You're down, but you're not down. Just set you on fire. Okay. Well, let's see if y'all had anything worth getting in here. Nice. A book we didn't have. Zooming uses less stamina. Oh, that's a good one. And I'll just... I'll read you... I'll just scrap you down, because you're not worth... K, uh, keeping an inventory spot open. Anything else in here? All your lockers are empty. Somebody's already been here. I think the last time I came through here, I was pretty much on top of this truck in this entire little area. Nice. Free shotgun shells is nice. I think there's ammo box back here. I don't need those, but I'll take that and that. And another level five sledgy. Fantastic. Okay. Things are looking up for half a second. Let's hop up here and get a nice lay of the land. Things will come out in just a second. All right, what can we get rid of? Okay, we don't need that. That we can scrap. That we can scrap. All right, we got four spaces left. That's that's not going to be enough to even remotely handle the main loot, but I'm not too worried about it right now. All right, I think everybody's in that place, and I know we got to go up on top of the building. we got to activate some stuff over there. Horrible things happen on the roof. The last, let's see what happens again. I'm going to predict this. The last time I was at this place, I went up this ladder, I got hit by a bird, and got an infection. Hey, look, there's a dog. I wonder how many people were like, hey, Cap, there's a dog right next to you, dude. I see it. Ooh, another munitions box. I need to get that. What? Oh, barbed wire. I was like, how could I have possibly hurt myself with that jump? <laughs> All right, y'all be careful for a second. I want to go ahead and get your ammo. Okay, well, you stack. Oh, sure, I'll take the bullet casings. I'll take the bullet casings. Could use those. See how many of these idiots we can 
probably not wake up. Shh, you didn't hear that. Whoops, that wasn't a headshot. It's okay, you took one in the shoulder. He's a shoulder boy. Now you can give my arrow back. And you and your little buddy can just lay down and stay down. All right, let's have... Again? Seriously, Cap, stop hitting the freaking barbed wire. You moron. Okay, inside that building sucks. I'm just trying to make sure there's nothing out, anything else here that's going to hurt me. Okay, let's go ahead and gather up the rest of the good stuff that's down here. All the free gas. Oh, nice! The super corn stash. Yeah! Teach you how to craft super corn? Fantastic! And some super corn seeds! Oh, yeah! I don't have to try and find Bob's boars anymore and have to deal with Grace. Fantastic. Thank you, game. So if you come to the NDC checkpoint right outside the buy-and-go store inside this place, there's literally a, a chest. It was called the Super Corn Container. Fantastic. Thank you, game. I appreciate you giving me something I actually want and need for a change. That's just very kind of you. And very, very not like you at all. Can I open you from this side? I kind of want you to let me out right here so I can go put some stuff on my bike. I guess you're not going to do that. I mean, I could hop over the wall and make my way back up. Okay, we got to be careful now. God dang it. <laughs> okay, I didn't get an infection that time. I think mostly just because I have armor, you know, that gives me critical chance to prevention stuff. So I think that's the main reason why. Because I'm pretty sure that stupid bird would have full on given me the clap. Nice. All of y'all can eat an entire bag. Did you have anything good up here? I will break down your pallets. That drops inside. We're not going in there yet. Military goods. Ammo. Nice. I can use that. And I'll just read you because I've only got one more space left. So what I really need to fix, the switch I need to push is up there, and that opens up that door right there. Don't startle me. That's what happens when you jump out at me. You get wrecked, sir. Who are you? You're on fire, man. All right, well, let's see what you had in your shotgun messiah box. See if you're keeping anything worth getting here. How about a level five pump? Ooh, how about an auto shoddy? Or a, a magazine, that works too. Go ahead and read you. Put you back on. And then I guess I'll take the machine gun parts. We're definitely going to be dropping some stuff off. Pump shoddy quality four. So I could make one. It wouldn't be a tremendous increase. A tremendous increase from a level three. But I guess it's slightly better. Let me make sure everything else is good. Hang on. Just in case, because I'm almost certain that there's another bird up here. I see ya. Get your ass out of my face. Hey, you're like glitching through the world, dude. Way to go, idiot. Sit on my face. That was not called for. Well, did you have anything up here to make it worth all that effort? Besides the button, of course. It's open. All right, now we can run inside and just absolutely get obliterated by all the zombies that's in here. Okay. So we're going to try and do this. Wait. Okay, I'm just going to break it. If you land on top of it, it breaks apart here. But you can beat on it for a second. Plus, a little bit of free iron. Why not? How many of y'all got really bothered by the fact that I was using the wrong tool there? Did it just really set you off? Are, are you, like, gritting your teeth? Okay, you're good. You're good. You're good. All right, we're good. All right, let's do this. Tell you what, I'll at least try to start off snealthy. I'm going to get your ammo real quick. Hey, nice. That's not what I'm currently using, but I'll, I'll scrap you down, and I appreciate it. All right, well, let's see. Do you have any books that I haven't read yet? You got that one and vehicle crafting. I do need to get you up a little bit higher. I know I'm encumbered. We're going to find this filing cabinet. Gonna be com Oh, nice. Sure, I'll go ahead, and I need to go ahead and get rid of some things. Like the little bit of sand, I get rid of that. All right, that'll clear up a few spaces there, so we at least can try and search some of the other stuff that's in here. Nice, another food crafting. I can make chili dogs. Oh, yeah. Sonic would be super proud of me. All right, get you reload real quick. If we could get a couple sneaky kills before everybody in here knows that we're here, I would be, I would be very much appreciative. Shh. 
Yeah. He didn't wake up anybody else. Nice. Read you. Let me see. I can take you. And I thought I had a regular bandage. I guess not. No big deal. I mean, I could pick up the cloth and make one. I'm not, eh, I'm not going to worry about that. Did I get my bolt back from you? I think I did. All right. Well, what did you have in the bathroom with you? It's kind of a weird place for shelving like this, but sure. Why not? Leave all the rest of that behind, and I guarantee you there's no toilet pistol, just some nasty paper. Cool. Okay, so I think... Did you make me any coffee? Nope. You know, I've had a lot of people, and I mean a tremendous number of people, ask me if my game is glitched or broken because they find coffee way more often than I do. And I just want to say, you don't have to rub it in. I'm aware that I don't get coffee nearly as often as pretty much everybody else who plays this game. But you don't have to rub it in, okay? Are you a feral? Ugh. Well, that's not going to go well. Might as well turn the light on and get this party started here. Shoot you through the door. Shoot you in the nards. I'm sorry, dude. I wasn't even aiming at you when you dealt with all that. All right, who do we have over here? Rawr! We got a blobby. And we got a white. Hey, blobby. Quit it, dude. Uh-uh. Back up, dude. Lisa? Come running up at me like that. You don't know who I am. And your little and your little pal, too. At least you brought me a trick-or-treating bag. There better be something good in it. Coffee! Nice. Cheers to you, Lisa. Thank you very much for not sucking. A note to all the rest of you. You see what Lisa did? How she brought me some coffee? She hit me once, but she brought me some coffee. And some freaking money, too. See, that's how you do that. Bunch of rude-ass zombies. You never bring me anything. All right, we are definitely going to have to drop some crap off in the bike before. That's not where I wanted to go. Wait, how the hell do I, how do I get it? Oh, yeah, I forgot. There's I can go up and out that direction. OK, so I'm not going to be able to drop much off. Wait, I think that opened up the main gate, didn't it? Like right over here. Yes. OK, we're clear for a second. I can drop off a bunch of stuff in the bike. Go ahead and put all of. Okay, that's not much in there. Okay, what about a quick stack? Anything else? That should give me enough space to pick up all the stuff that is good here. Nice. I would say that was a professional level clear. What do you guys think? Maybe I'm biased because, you know, it's me. But I'd say I did a pretty good job there. We got tagged only a couple times. Level 5 hunting rifles, not terrible. Ammo, and we got at least some buckshot so we can make some more shotgun shells. And we got some there too, plus a treasure map. Oh, Nice. Nice. Ammo. I am always good with getting ammo. Ooh, a level five pistol. I mean, I have like three of them at the house, but still. You know what? I guess I'll start keep. I'm, I was going to say, I guess I'll start keeping those iron bolts just in case I do run out of steel bolts and I don't want to make any more. I'll have some. I've been scrapping all the rest of them, so I'm kind of behind <laughs> on keeping those to begin with. But eh, tis what it is. Here going forward, we'll do that, okay? Hobo stew? Sure, we get a little bit of the health back, get our food and water up. I'll just read you. I don't really need a blueberries. I'll leave those behind for the next survivor. Maybe when they show up here, they're going to be freaking hungry too. Um, yeah, tell you what. Let me read you. I know I'm encumbered. And I... <sighs> Wait, hang on. Let me read this real quick. I can't... What? Oh, is it because I have two other ones already? Well, tell you what. How about we'll cancel Claude's? Because it's a long ways away from us anyway. And then we'll read... Why? Why can't I read you? Cannot accept this quest at this time. But why? That's just mean. Don't give me a quest and then tell me I can't accept it. That's just mean. Uh, I don't need either one of those. All right, come on. auto shutting. Nope. Baton parts. We will definitely sell those. Another shotgun Messiah box. Auto shoddy? Ammo, book, and I can't take you. Tell you what, leave the meat behind and take you because I can sell you for more than what the meat's worth. Read you. More ammo for you. Fantastic. Iron crossbow quality six. Fantastic too. So the game's not hooking me up with an auto shoddy. Yes, I still have to get this one here. The game's not hooking me up with an auto shoddy, but it's at least giving me some stuff. I'm just checking to make sure I didn't miss any other lootable things in here before I do the final one. Like any more pallets or anything. 
random piece of ammo laying on the ground or something. Sometimes you guys were like, hey, Cap, you missed a pile of ammo right over there at such and such time. And I appreciate it. Usually by then I'm like two or three videos ahead and like, well, guess it's going to be forever lost to me then. All right, you're good. Okay, let's see if we can uh, let's switch over to a gun just in case we need to attack something. First try, nice. That's the way we do it. Nice some lock picks, ammo, money. Oh, you're in the okay. All right, let me put you on real quick. Read you, read you. You'll stack. And the rest of the stuff, I'm going to have to figure out a way to bring it with me here. Okay, so you're not going to let me read you. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. I don't know why you won't let me read you. I don't I don't like the fact that you won't let me read you. You know, tell you what, I'll just scrap you and I'll take the money because I can sell that. Uh, let me see. Can cat food. Tell you what, I'll just eat you even though I don't really need it. A minor helmet's not terrible, but I'm going to take the legendary parts first. Ooh, I have an idea. Okay, so let me take you and this. Modify and can slap you and you on there. That'll clear up a couple spaces. That'll allow me to take this, take my those back. And I kind of want those two bandages. Not gonna lie. Is there anything else I could just get rid of? Baton parts? You know what? I'll end up just selling those because I'm not using that anyway. And I have plenty of the house. All right. We are as chunky as you can get. We got no more space on us and our bike is even full. But we completed it cleared it even wait hang on isn't there a way for me to get up here i think hold on because i want mostly just because i want to see if i get my bolts back what are the seriously stop it can i ah screw your barbed wire there we go now can i have my bolts back or are they long since gone they look long since gone to me Okay, well, let's jump in here and see if there's anything fun we miss, like a soldier boy. Surprise! You didn't see anything. Not sure why you didn't wake up through all of this, but okay. More ammo, cool. Some more first aid. I can do a quick take of all you. Just read both of those. I don't really need any of the rest of this. Now, I kind of wants it, but I can't take any of it. <laughs> We're ammo. I need a bigger backpack mod. Yes, I know there are some out there that give you just a ridiculous amount of space, but we know me. We absolutely know me. If I had extra back, backpack space, I would still be encumbered. I'd just have more stuff with me. Ooh, nice coal. We need all of that. Wood, we don't need. I just dropped off what I did have. More military goods. Okay, we can read all those too. I can make a pistol quality six. It's not terrible. Not terrible. Now, I do know, and I'm sure people will tell me this. They're like, hey, Cap, if you would stop carrying so much of your tools around with you and change of outfit every five minutes, you'd be doing just fine. I know. I know. I know. Be, be nice. All right. Tell you what. I'll repair you, and then I'll take you. That'll clear up an extra space. I'm glad I dropped in here. There's some good stuff in here, like ammo. What are you? Lumberjack hat, and wood harvest, twenty percent. See, I could, I could totally switch over and do lumberjack stuff. <laughs> it's just, we have too much crap on us. Headlights actually are okay. You know what? Let's let's do that. Is there anything else in here that I can't live without? And how do I get back out of here? Just the way I came. How the hell do I get out of here now? Is there a button I can push to open the door? Let me out of here. I'm trapped, man. Trapped like a rat. There we go. Good lord. There's probably a much, much easier way to go about getting out of there, and then I just didn't figure it out. We have a small wandering horde. Not worried about any of y'all. I need to go drop a bunch of stuff off at the house and then talk to Trader Dude. It's all nice and cloudy outside. Don't burp at me. That's just rude, dude. All right, we got inventory space again, so we can go get whatever he's going to give us. Got a couple things we can sell. Got to remember to put the hat on. I'm so glad our base held up as well as it did, because then I don't have to worry about... Oh, that's just fantastic. I don't have to worry about um, spending forever fixing it up. Just, you know, a few taps here and there, we're good to go. 
Smell. Congratulations. Smells like what? Gunpowder would be good. Tactical warfare. Eh, I think the gunpowder would probably be the most beneficial because then I could make ammo that I need. But I, whoosh, flaming arrows, no. Glues, easy to make. I'll take the gunpowder. What? Uh, actually, I'll sell hold. you food, but don't expect me to cook it for you. I would never ask you to cook me anything. Wait, you don't want my shovel? That's just weird. Okay, well, you didn't really buy that much from me. Not that much at all. Um, well, I, what if I took the mods off? Would you want... A sale is a sale. A sale is a sale. Yeah, you're right. Okay, if I take off these, would you want to buy it now? Nope. How about the mods? Would you want to buy them separately? Because I have some of those at the house. You want a treasure map? I don't know why it won't let me read this right now. Normally, you can't have more than one at a time, which I only have the one. I guess we need to go do Sarah's treasure map tomorrow. Good to see you, sir. I'm going to hit you right in the nose with a shovel because you suck. Wrong one. No, that's the right one. There we go. I'm going to turn my headlamp back on. Sweet. Oh, wait. Hang on just a second. Do you... Take a look, but don't expect me to hold your hand through it. Shut up. No. You don't okay. buy something next time, I'll shoot you. So somebody had said if I got a quad pocket mod then I could replace some of the ones that I have. Like in my armor, I have, let's say for this one, I have a single here, I have a triple and a double there. I've got a triple and a double, triple and a single. So if I could get like another double or another uh, a quad or something, then what I could do is I could take it off of this one. You know what? Hang on. How many mod slots? Okay, hang on. Ooh, an idea. Uh, hang on. Brain is sparking here. Careful, it might go start a fire. Let's take you off here. Slap you on there. That'll give us the same amount of inventory space. And now I've got an extra spot on here. I can put that intelligence boost I have on there. And the next kill point I have, I can get Daring Adventurer up one more. I like the fact that it opens and closes really fast, too. Ooh, wait, 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 hang on. I need to kill you. I need some more of you off the checklist here. Thank you. Appreciate it. Let's see, how many more of you do I need? Five. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. Nice. See, I'm almost certain I have an intelligence mod over here. Make sure nothing showed up. We're good. All right, let's double check and see if I actually do. And I think I do. I don't think I got rid of any of those. Fortitude mod. I thought I had an intelligence mod. There it is. Okay, it's right. Th oh, yeah, baby. Okay, so, hey. Um, tell you what, what I'll do is I'll go ahead and take you real quick. I slapped it on here just so I wouldn't accidentally scrap it. Intellect, I'll take you and put you on here. And then what I'll do is open you up, modify, slap you. What? Oh, it's because I have the Treasure Hunter mod on there. That's why. Because getting the extra XP gains nice. But it's only 10% XP and the loot stage. I think I'm okay. I think I'd much rather have the other one than that. It kind of sucks that you can't put both of them on there. One's a chip and one's a headband. It's okay. But now that'll open up. So now we have our intellect bumped up to 7. So when I get another skill point, I can open up and get this one. Not... Yeah, this one. So I get uh, better trade, access to better items... And the ones I get down here, which you got to have in like level 10, long ways away, then I can pick two items for each one. That'll be pretty sweet. All right, I'm going to stick you in there for later because I don't need you right at the moment. I need to clean up some. Look at this. I need... That's not what I wanted to click. What did I just do? Oh, I have a lot of headlamps. I have a lot of freaking headlamps. I could sell some of those. Anyway... That's going to do it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like on the video. Of course, if you're new here, make sure you subscribe if you're not already so you don't miss out on future videos. In the meantime, you guys have a wonderful day, and I will talk to you later.